Nobody, uh-oh, did you see some? No! Oh my God, no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Everybody has a crush and celebrities are no different than us. So what happens when a celebrity meets a fellow celebrity crush? Well, in today's video, we are going to look at the top 10 times celebrities met their crush. Number 10. Nick Jonas and Amelia Clark. Can we really blame Nick for this one? Who wouldn't want to meet the mother of dragons? As a big fan of the show, Game of Thrones, the Jonas brother was more than thrilled when he had the chance to meet his favorite colossi, Amelia Clark. The singer met the actress for the first time at the Oscars after party and was extremely flustered. He even told her that he was a big fan of her Instagram account, which she thought was really sweet. When the actress was scheduled to appear on the BBC Radio 1 breakfast show, Nick Jonas was invited as well and introduced as her big fan. He admitted how he's embarrassed the first time and even joked about being able to get on the show with her. Amelia in her cheerful witty way commented that he surely can come and ride a dragon. Good one, Nick. Hi, I'm good. How are you? You, you really set me up for failure to not what do look you mean? cool at all. Why? <laughs> one of your biggest fans is in the building. <laughs> Number 9, Ollie Murs and Mila Kunis. The singer Ollie Murs has not left it a secret at all that he has a rather huge crush on actress Mila Kunis. The singer was performing on the Graham Morton show, and the actress, too, happened to be a guest that night to discuss her movie Oz, and the singer was left red in the face while the host exposed his crush in front of Mila. At an interview, he even said if he could have kids with anyone, it would be her. The star, of course, was extremely flattered and didn't know how else to react to this revelation. The cheeky co-signer even went on to say that Ollie and Mila sound good together. Well, we can only wonder what Ashton thinks about this. Someone tweeted you uh, this question. If you could have kids with any celeb, oh, no. who would you have them with? Oh, no. <laughs> Do you remember your answer, Ollie? It's, it, it's not the You did it last time. <laughs> You did oh. this. <laughs> oh. <It's fine. laughs> Number 8. Diane Keaton and Justin Bieber. This is a duo we never saw coming. The one and only Diane Keaton fawning over young Justin Bieber is a hard one to pass up on our list. In a hilarious segment on The Ellen DeGeneres Show, Diane Keaton confessed to being highly attracted to Justin Bieber and his shirtless body. During a game of Would You Rather, the actress was unable to choose between Jared Leto and the Beeves because she felt strongly for the Beeves. Ellen then surprised her by bringing out the star as a surprise. Needless to say, Bieber was flattered and Diane was flustered like all the teenage girls with Bieber fever. You won't believe who we have next. No! Oh my God, no! Oh no! Oh no! Number 7. Ariana Grande and Jim Carrey. Who would have guessed that the young and talented Ariana Grande was a Jim Carrey fan? While the rest of the world would love a chance to meet her, Ariana was granted a chance to meet her favorite sellout. Long crush, like it kind of all just goes together. It's Jim Carrey, I love him so much. Oh my God. She was such a big fan of the actor growing up that she even ran a fan account of him when she was younger. The comedian tweeted out a quote about mental health that Grant A had posted and needless to say she completely lost it. When she didn't get the chance to meet the actor, they shared a sweet hub and picture on Instagram. The actress even went on to make a cameo on his show, Kidding. Talk about wholesome. Number 6. Taylor Swift and Justin Timberlake. Oh, Justin Timberlake. Justin Timberlake is yeah. your favorite, really? Yeah. The most unlikely singing duo coming together is something that dreams are made of. Who didn't have a slight crush on Justin Timberlake while growing up? Well, Taylor, like all of us, has always been a huge fan and was given the opportunity to meet her childhood crush on The Ellen Show. When asked about her experience at the Grammys, Taylor was quoted as saying she was hoping she would get a chance to meet the Mirrors singer. The next time Taylor came on her show, the host surprised Taylor by bringing out Justin Timberlake. The singer began freaking out and was visibly flustered. Yeah, we would be flustered too, Taylor. Justin kindly complimented Taylor on her sweet voice. He later went on to attend her 25th birthday, and they also both shared the stage with Beyonce. Dreams really do come true. Number 5. Charlize Theron and Michael B. Jordan The most unexpected duo we never thought we needed, but we certainly do. Yet again, on The Ellen Show, Charlize was able to meet up with her crush, none other than the hunky Michael B. Jordan himself. In a game of Would You Rather, 
They're on shows Michael over Brad Pitt and Ellen decided to take the opportunity to unite the two of them. She casually called the actor onto the stage and Charlize commented calling Ellen terrible. They continue to flirt and even hold hands on the show making several jokes about it. However, sad for us it just turned out to be friendly and teasing, with Ellen joking that Charlize took too long and now he's probably not single. Better luck next time Charlize! Enjoying the video! Keep watching! Number 4 Simone Biles meets Zac Efron Zac Efron has been the reigning heartthrob for close to a decade now. It is no wonder that the young gymnast is a huge fan. The Olympic star is open about her crush on the actor, and this resulted in the news reaching the star. Once he started looking up gymnastics a bit, he realized how amazing the young Biles is and her outstanding performance representing America at the Olympic. He couldn't resist but decided to go meet her himself. In a wholesome turn of events, Efron made it to Brazil to meet the gymnast in person. Her dreams came true from a cardboard cut out in her room to meeting the star in person. They shared the sweet moment on Instagram and have been in star friends ever since. She also shared a hilarious behind the scene picture of her apparently fainting after meeting Efron. Number 3. Amelia Clark and Matt Leblanc. Yeah, kind of. Did you get to talk to him? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Amelia. This time the tables were turned when it was everyone's favorite Colissey, who got to meet her celebrity crush. As a huge Friends fan, the actress had a crush on Matt LeBlanc, famous for portraying the character of Joey Tribbiani. In an episode of The Graham Norton Show, Amelia and Matt were both guests on the same night. Graham pointed out that Clark was a huge fan and Amelia shyly revealed that she thinks Matt is crazy wicked. She even made the request if he would ask her his famous line of, how you doing? To which the actor cheekily obliged. He in turn replied that he was a fan of her show Game of Thrones as well and admitted that he needed to catch up on episodes as well. Number 2. Charlie Puth and Jennifer Aniston One of the sweetest and wholesome celebrity encounters has got to be Charlie Puth and his longtime female crush, Jennifer Aniston. On The Ellen Show, Charlie got the chance to do what he always dreamed of doing. Unbeknownst to the singer, Ellen invited her close friend Aniston, who waited patiently to come and surprise Charlie. The singer is a huge Friends fan and has always had a crush on the character Rachel. Once she came out on the stage, the singer completely lost it. His shell-shocked face has been immortalized over the interest. Aniston proceeded to sit next to him and affectionately put her arm around the singer who seemed like he was in a state of shock the entire time. He jokingly stated that he was very comfortable because she sat close to him and that she smelled really good. This is good. This looks very good together. And I like this. You smell so good. Thank you. And right at the top we have number one, Billie Eilish and Justin Bieber. We saved the best for the very last. The most epic duo of the music industry is none other than Billie Eilish and the Biebs himself. When the young bad guy singer began to gain fame, she did her first ever Ellen show. While she was sitting backstage, she revived an actual DM from the Biebs himself who had heard that she was a huge fan. She had cardboard cutouts and merchandise from Bieber as a young girl. She had even sent him DMs when she was younger. But as her dream came true, he really did reply. The best moment for her was when they finally met and at Coachella of all places. She completely freaked out, got a hug from the Biebs, and stood close to him while watching the performances. The two danced together and are now close friends. They even did a remix of her song Bad Guy together. Well, that's all for today. Who is your celebrity crush? Leave us a comment below. Please like and share the video. Please subscribe to the channel and do not forget to hit the notification bell so you do not miss another update from us.